For all episodes and more information, please visit us at MarriedMillions.com. I wouldn't recommend starting in the restaurant business together as a couple if you've never worked in the restaurant business. Um, a lot of people, whether it's individuals or couples, get into the restaurant business and don't really realize what they're getting into. Um, they aren't anticipating 12 to 14 hour days. They aren't anticipating not having their Friday and Saturday nights off. They aren't anticipating... Different schedules. Yeah, a schedule that's different from the rest of the world. Um, or even from each other kind of thing. You know, I mean, you go thinking that you're going to be working maybe all the time together. Oh, how pretty. But, you know, the day off that you have is not the day off that she has necessarily. You know, we're not necessarily off all the time together. And we try. But, you know, when we open seven days a week and all that, we're basically two, two different entities at the restaurant. In the beginning, we had to take separate vacations. We couldn't even take vacation together when right. we were getting things up and running because we always felt that at least one of us needed to be in the building. Now we can right. take vacation together. But um, you <laughs> well, definitely need to understand the restaurant industry and, you know, be prepared not only for a lot of hard work, but for, you know, splitting that work between you and not necessarily spending quality time together. You'll be working, but not. Right. Yeah, not a lot of personal think, oh, time together. together. <laughs> so pretty kind of thing, but you, know, you gotta think. It depends in, in what kind of industry. In our industry, if we were both in the kitchen, it would be a different deal. We would be both in the kitchen all the time. Let's say, I, I know, uh, uh, couples with their both chefs, so they're basically in the kitchen most of the time together, sort of thing. But a lot of time, one has to spend the other one's role, so you know, the front of the house can be taken care of and whatnot. And so it depends a lot on. When he, when we were the first year and a half, he, he did it by himself and you know, just got to the point where he didn't yeah, want to do, house, do, do, do both <laughs> by himself anymore and that's when I got the phone call that day. You need to quit your job right now. <laughs> but uh, you know, I think one of the things that makes it easier for us is that we have had different roles in the restaurant industry. So we're kind of splitting the two major aspects of running the business. Um, and you know, his strength is creativity and you know my strength is more organizational, and I think that's a good balance for the two of us. And you would suggest that same balance for other couples as well? I think it helps. I think it helps cover both of the bases of running a restaurant. If you don't have that, I wouldn't say don't do it, but you're gonna need somebody else that has that other skill that you're lacking. <laughs> easier time of it than Hector does is at home I try to not focus too much on work try to make sure we have you know a relationship other than something that revolves around work um, and it, it it's hard sometimes too um, because even though we spend 12 hours in the same building sometimes we barely get a chance to talk to each other all day because we're both so busy with our own aspects of the job, so that the only time we do get to talk is at home or in the car when we're commuting together, you know, about things related to the business. Um, but I can, I can be pretty good at turning it off at work um, and on vacation. Right. But, I mean, to me, it depends on what you're doing. And I, well, I do something very personal, our cooking and our restaurant and the concept. So that's all I'm thinking all the time. It doesn't matter if I'm. But it would be the same if I was working in another restaurant or somewhere else. I mean, here even more because we had the ability to concentrate both efforts into, you know, that one effort and, and, and put out, put a vida, a restaurant together out. Uh, but it 
it's kind of difficult sometimes even to think, oh, let's go and work together to do something. To me, the best aspect is that, that you're both playing for the same team. Sort of thing. Exactly.